Hello and welcome to the National Academy of Television Arts and Sciences Student Production Awards. I'm your host, Amy Lang. Of course, we would rather be with you in person to celebrate with family and friends, but given these unique circumstances, we will celebrate the best in college and high school production with this virtual award ceremony. So let's get to our first category, College Photographer. The nominees are Be Stronger Enough, Michigan State University, Help Portrait, Mott Community College, In a Way, She's Still Here, Michigan State University, Journey of a Ginger, Amanda Taylor, Washtenaw Community College. And the award goes to Be Stronger Enough, Michigan State University. Congratulations. Come on, get your punch up a little, eye level. Really, it's the kids he cares about the most because it makes them strong, well, actually, Jalen says it perfectly. Be stronger enough. And then combination number three. One, two, and move. One, two, now move. For almost 30 years, Coach Easley has opened up his crowned boxing club to kids like Zaire Doyle. I like boxing because I can just get stressed out. If I'm holding something in, I can just like hit the bag. Our next category is high school photographer. And the nominees are Have a Nice Day, Dearborn High School, Still New York, Troy Athens High School, Electric Oddity, Dearborn High School. And the award goes to Have a Nice Day, Dearborn High School. Okay, I'll see you at eight. Hello? Listen, I, I don't want to talk about this right now, okay? No, I, I can't. Congratulations. Our next category is College News General Assignment. And the nominees are, they're no different than traditional sports, Michigan State University. I don't know if I was nervous, Michigan State University. I wanna see what freedom looks like today, Michigan State University. In a way, she's still here, Michigan State University. And the award goes to, I don't know if I was nervous, Michigan State University. Congratulations. Forensic entomologist sounds like something a TV show is made of. And in this case... Thanks, Doc. Thanks for taking the meeting. I appreciate yeah, this. Meet it was. We were part of this process that potentially could open up the case. Dr. Ben Bow stars in an episode of Smiley Face Killers, The Hunt for Justice on the Oxygen Network. I don't know if I was nervous. Um, I don't know if I was excited. Our next category, High School News, General Assignment. And the nominees are 2019 Mock Disaster, LISD TV, Homelessness, Rockford High School Broadcasting, Line 5, Haley Croft, Davison Schools, Water Levels, Rebecca Allen, Davison Schools, Rewired, Rockford High School Broadcasting, Flint Water, Still a Crisis, Royal Oak High School. And the award goes to Rewired, Rockford High School Broadcasting. Congratulations. We started to see students younger trying to get access to not only the street drugs, but to now to pharmaceuticals. The fact that they believe that they're safe because they're made by a company. Anything that you introduce to the brain before it's complete with development has the ability to change the way that the brain functions. There is nothing more paralyzing than watching your child die. Uh, he had been abusing opiates, uh, I found out later. She had had knee surgery the, the summer of her senior year. Our next category, college long form nonfiction. And the nominees are Street Team, Mott Community College, Basics Basketball, Pyramid of Skill, Ferris State University, Rise, Michigan State University, What Happened to Henry, Michigan State University. And the award goes to What Happened to Henry, Michigan State University. Congratulations. As much as they were integrated schools, the lunchroom and, and, and activities were very segregated. So you had your tables that the black sat at, the tables that the white sat at, and there was not too many intermingling. But if you would draw a Venn diagram with circles of the, the jocks, the popular kids, we sort of overlapped all of them. We were having fun. We, we were playing music, drums. We enjoyed sports. We enjoyed girls. So what more could two guys want? Our next category, high school arts and entertainment, cultural affairs. And the nominees are 
the Walker Literacy Center, Troy Athens High School. And the award goes to the Walker Literacy Center, Troy Athens High School. Congratulations. The Walker Literacy Center is a nonprofit organization that focuses on helping children in the Detroit area better their literacy skills outside of the schooling system. It was founded by Julie Liber. I was um, reading a news article about Detroit Public Schools and the kids' um, reading scores in particular. So I wanted to start something. I wanted to use my skills of knowing how to teach kids how to read. Our next category, College Director, and the nominees are Sidelined, Mott Community College, Distorted, Washtenaw Community College, and the award goes to Distorted, Washtenaw Community College. Our next category, High School Director, and the nominees are the Michigan Arctic Grayling Initiative, Troy Athens High School, Hannah Forsetto Director Reel, Royal Oak High School, The High Road, Dearborn High School, DTV Director Davison Schools, and the award goes to The High Road, Dearborn High School. Congratulations. Day school, I can already tell that this is a joke. It's only the first day events. I'm sure it'll get better. But that's the thing. Why do we have to wait for stuff to get better? That's just life events. Do I really need to know the midpoint of some line for the future? Probably not. It's not all that bad. I'm excited for the new science lab they're building. The next category, college sports. And the nominees are play by play, day by day, Michigan State University. Be stronger enough, Michigan State University. And the award goes to play by play, day by day, Michigan State University. Congratulations. Michigan State junior Eric Bach hasn't missed a Friday night football game in a long time. But he doesn't sit in the stands or play on the field. First down, fix that shoulder pad. Don't have to, we got quarter coming. Down, down, down. Had him in, touchdown. He's the referee. Our next category, high school talent. And the nominees are DTV talent, Davison Schools, Ben Bosher Talent Reel, Rockford High School Broadcasting, Carly Kelly Talent Reel, Rockford High School Broadcasting, Paige Johnson Talent Reel, Rockford High School Broadcasting. And the award goes to DTV Talent, Davison Schools. Congratulations. Getting this information to the right people is critical in dangerous situations and can save lives. Once outside of the building, do not run towards law enforcement officers. Cops are on high alert during these situations and are looking for the attackers. Running towards them may be dangerous, especially with objects in your hand. Our next category, college short form fiction. And the nominees are Sock Monkey, Washtenaw Community College, The Inside Out, Mott Community College, Foreshadow, Ferris State University, The Call, Calvin University, and the award goes to The Call, Calvin University. Congratulations. I guess. What are you doing at the bridge at five in the morning? It's none of your business. Okay. I'm Melanie. What's your name? Tim. Hi, Tim. Our next category is High School Short Form Fiction, and the nominees are The Runoff, Troy Athens High School, Zorkor, Rockford High School Broadcasting, Electric Oddity, Dearborn High School, Optimism, Troy Athens High School, Girlfriends, Dearborn High School, Grave Beginnings, Rockford High School Broadcasting, Daydreamin', Royal Oak High School, and the award goes to Daydreamin', Royal Oak High School. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. 
Our next category is College Public Service Announcements, or PSAs, and the nominees are Self Love, Michigan State University, Give to Seedlings, Madonna University, Flint Institute of Music PSA, Mott Community College, Save the Environment, Michigan State University, and the award goes to Save the Environment, Michigan State University. Congratulations. Our next category, the High School Public Service Announcements, or PSAs. The nominees are It Will Be, Troy Athens High School, Tech Wow, LISD TV, Heads Up, Phones Down, Davison Schools, Victories, Rockford High School Broadcasting. And the award goes to It Will Be, Troy Athens High School. Congratulations. 4.6 million American children and minors are living in homes with at least one loaded and unlocked firearm. 73% of children aged 9 and under reported knowing the location of their parents' firearms. 36% admitted that they had handled the weapons, including many whose parents had reported their children did not know the location. Our next category, College Writing, and the nominees are Be Stronger Enough, Michigan State University, in a way, she's still here, Michigan State University. And the award goes to Be Stronger Enough, Michigan State University. Congratulations. Besides running a boxing business, Easily finds it's important to give back to his community. It gives him a sense of workout, figure how to like develop work skills, hard work. A counterpunch to kids having to roam the streets with nothing to do. I get a lot of satisfaction out of it by seeing the growth and development of the kids seeing them do better in school, seeing that they're not getting, you know, arrested or in trouble. Our next category, high school writing, and the nominees are Caesar Rodney, Troy Athens High School, Electric Oddity, Dearborn High School, and the award goes to Electric Oddity, Dearborn High School. Congratulations. Good, like, yeah, but like side, like back, like I just stop, you're fine. Our next category is College Newscast, and the nominees are Focal Point News, December 6, 2019, Michigan State University. Focal Point News, March 22, 2019, Michigan State University. Focal Point News, November 22, 2019, Michigan State University. And the award goes to Focal Point News, December 6, 2019, Michigan State University. Congratulations. Only two presidents in American history have been impeached, but that number could become three by Christmas. After over two months of investigation, impeachment proceedings against President Donald Trump are moving into a new phase. Speaker Nancy Pelosi announced yesterday that she is directing the House Judiciary Committee to draft articles of impeachment for the House of Representatives for a vote. Trump is accused of withholding aid to Ukraine in exchange for investigating the son of his political... Our next category is High School Newscast, and the nominees are from Lake Orion High School, the Sellout Edition, SHS Today, Celine High School, Lenaway 104, LISD TV, and again from Lake Orion High School, the Telethon Edition. And the award goes to SHS Today, Celine High School, SWWC. Congratulations. Look forward to seeing more of this in the future, and if you are interested in being one, in one of these exclusive interviews yourself, contact Mr. Bush in room C244 for more information. The annual polar plunge is upon us and registration is now open. Here is a quick informational video to tell you more. Our next category, College Long Form Fiction, and the nominees are Reggie, Michigan State University, Thorns, Mott Community College, Detestable Tendencies, Hope College. And the award goes to two winners in this category, 
Reggie, Michigan State University and Detestable Tendencies, Hope College. Congratulations. <laughs> Hey, I'll give you this shoe if you'll let me sell your legs. And I feel like every guy here would give me just that. Take our hero, for example. <laughs> I bet the only notable thing you could get out of that guy is a free drink. Well, looks like we're gonna find out. Jess, come on. Our next category is high school long form fiction, and the nominees are Have a Nice Day, Dearborn High School, Fact or Fable, LISD TV, and the award goes to Have a Nice Day, Dearborn High School. Congratulations. Go, oh, it's so big. I'm sure if we take the elevator, we can make it to the top. Hugo? Well, I'd rather be up there than down here. Our next category is College Editor. The nominees are Be Stronger Enough, Michigan State University, Distorted, Washtenaw Community College, and the award goes to Distorted, Washtenaw Community College. Congratulations. <laughs> Our next category, High School Editor, and the nominees are The Year of Slack, Troy Athens High School, Electric Oddity, Dearborn High School, Grace Jew Editing Reel, Troy Athens High School, and the award goes to The Year of Slack, Troy Athens High School. Congratulations. Our next category, college, short form nonfiction. And the nominees are Detroit's Armenia, Madonna University, Wetback, Washtenaw Community College, Muskegon River Watershed Assembly, Ferris State University, Food Foundations, Washtenaw Community College. It was all the fashion, Washtenaw Community College. And the award goes to Wetback. Washtenaw Community College. Congratulations. We use a lot of the rainwater for plants, corn and beans and squash. Meat was never a thing that we ate because the chickens were safe for, to, to create eggs. And the cows that grandpa had were for the milk that we drink and make cheese of it. But we never killed animals. Our next category is high school short form nonfiction. The nominees are the Journey of a Lifetime, Celine High School. Great Lakes on the Brink, Davison Schools. The Double, Celine High School. The Michigan Arctic Grayling Initiative, Troy Athens High School. And the award goes to Great Lakes on the Brink, Davison Schools. Congratulations. And, it's, and it is a massive undertaking. In fact, all five Great Lakes have hit record highs in the past year and are expected to only climb further in the coming seasons. As of the beginning of November, Lake Superior was 16 inches above its long-term monthly average. The waters of Lake Ontario reached 19 inches higher. Lake Erie challenged its norm by 28 inches. And as for the connecting lakes, Huron and Michigan rested at 36 inches above their long-term monthly average. Our next category, College Commercial. The nominees are FSU 2020 Admissions Commercial, Ferris State University, Ypsilanti Automotive Heritage Museum, Washtenaw Community College, and the award goes to Ypsilanti Automotive Heritage Museum, Washtenaw Community College. Congratulations. With the number one buys on the number one car, proved that hydromatic driving is smoother, 
more effortless driving. Smooth, efficient torque multiplication at the transmission. With Oldsmobile's Hydromatic Drive, there's no clutch pedal to push, and the usual gear shifter is replaced by this simple direction selector. The new Chevrolet completely out... Our next category is College Animation Graphics Special Effects, and the nominees are... Reggie, Michigan State University, and the award goes to Reggie, Michigan State University. Congratulations. <laughs> Our next category, High School Animation Graphics Special Effects, and the nominees are DTV Graphics Reel, Davison Schools, See the Stars, Troy Athens High School, and the award goes to See the Stars, Troy Athens High School. Congratulations. Congratulations to all of the nominees and recipients. We are so proud to honor you and your schools with the best in student production. And now before we wrap our awards show, we are proud to present this year's scholarship and grant awardees. The National Academy of Television Arts and Sciences Michigan High School grants First, one of $2,000 awarded to Lee M. Thurston High School in Redford, Michigan. Congratulations. And the following are $1,000 grants awarded to Plymouth High School, Troy Athens High School, and Lake Orion High School. Congratulations. We're proud to present the Undergraduate Scholarship Awards to Summer Williams, Mott Community College. That's an award of $3,500. Another one to Chris Kaufman, Central Michigan University, also for $3,500. Congratulations to you. And on behalf of the National Academy of Arts and Sciences, Michigan Chapter, we thank you for joining us. <laughs>